Hi, it's Mitch from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Orioles versus White Sox Major League Baseball matchup on Wednesday, August 30th, 2023. Here on YouTube, I do tons of free pick videos, so be sure to subscribe to our channel. We do free picks every day at SportsChatPlace.com, PickDogs.com, right here on YouTube, as well as across social media and our live shows. And when you give out that many free picks, you're bound to like some games more than others. To find out which games those are, as well as to get best bets from the world's best handicappers, head on over to our website, PickDogs.com. Just click on the Premium Picks tab. While you're there, use the discount code PICK. You'll get 15% off all of your purchases of $19. $15 or more. We now also have the Pick Dogs Dime Club. This isn't for everyone, but if you're a larger better, well, then this could be for you. Just call the toll free number on the website, text the number on the website, you'll talk to a live person, they'll answer all your questions. But let's get to this one. Orioles taking on the White Sox and Kyle Gibson on the bump here for the O's and Dylan Cease on the mound for the White Sox. Tail of two teams in this one. The White Sox third worst record in the American League. That probably isn't going to change to the high side or to the low side. Just a lot of room in between them and the Royals who are below them and the Tigers who are above them. And I tell you when, you, when you mention the teams that are above and below them and they call them the third worst team in the American League, well, that just tells you how bad the American League Central is. So the White Sox probably not going to take a lot to move the needle and to move up in the American League Central next year. The American League Central, a division that hasn't been won by the same team two years in a row in a very, very long time. And I'll tell you, you know, last year, the Twins were out of it. This year, the Twins are winning the division. Uh, the year before that, you know, the year before they were out of it, they were winning the division again the year before that. So uh, you kind of get this where uh, just a lot of inconsistency from year to year going on in the American League Central. Dylan Cease on the mound here for the for the White Sox. And the thing about him is, you know, he's a guy that was mentioned uh, a lot around the trade deadline. You know, certainly a guy that the White Sox believe has some talent, but, you know, they thought maybe they could bring in more than what he actually does have. And, you know, what we've seen from Cease is a mix. You know, at times we see him be an absolute dominating pitcher. Other times he appears to be laboring and struggling. And it's just from, you know, year to year more than anything else. Last year he was sensational. This year, well, he hasn't really had the support either. So really tough to say. And I think that a lot of it has to do with what goes on in the clubhouse and the enthusiasm of the team. I mean, you see teams like the Milwaukee Brewers and the Seattle Mariners this time of year getting really excited about everything that goes on. And you see other teams like, you know, the Padres and, you know, the White Sox and, you know, some of these other teams that car the Cardinals where just no matter what happens, it just seems to be the whole tone is somewhat negative. And you got to turn that around to make things happen. You know, Kyle Gibson, who gets the ball here for the Orioles, is probably the weakest link in that Orioles rotation. I think the White Sox bats have a chance to get to him. I'll tell you, maybe I'm being a bit optimistic, but I'll take the White Sox in this one. And that's going to be my free pick. Of course, while you're doing your picks today, putting your bets in, be sure to use our free betting tools at sportschatplace.com. Our betting tools are 100% free in the way they work. They show you just how often all the bets on the board today actually hit. Then they show you today's odds, and from there, you can assess the risk-reward, putting yourself on the bets that come in the most and pay the most. That's how you make money, betting on sports.